I'm about to pick up a meat from the local butcher shop and you are coming with me. And we're also going to talk how meat from our farm gets, hopefully, to your table. But let's talk about the beef, how we raise it and how it ends up on a people plate, hopefully, maybe even yours. Unlike many farms around us, we don't actually have our own herd of cattle. Many years ago, we made decision to not do it. For a simple reason that it would require too much upfront investment and the, we would see the first product around two and a half to three years down the road. So instead what we are doing, we are going to the barn sales and we are getting one to three days newly born calves. Those are usually 100 to 120 pounds of weight and we bring them home. From there, it takes about months to bottle feed them. We, a task that falls usually between me and my wife, we do it together. After that, we're moving them to the grain. All our cattle is grain raised. Sorry, I know some people prefer a grass fed, but I do love my beef a grain raised. I think it gives more texture. I think it gives more marbling and I think it uh, makes meat better. It's just my personal preference and uh, people who get from me seem to have no complaint. Anyway, back to raising those calves. At age of three months, we add in the hay to the ration because at that time the rumen will be fully developed and they can actually digest the hay. We also vaccinate them, we bond them, and that's about it. From their own, they just grow. They always have access to the fresh air, to the pasture they can get out. As well, they have access to a sheltered area in case of the snow or the rain. One thing important I would like to mention that none of our cattle get antibiotics or gross hormones. Absolutely zero. None of our cattle has it. We raise them as naturally as we possibly can. Yes, as I mentioned, we do vaccinate them, but it's just vaccination to keep them healthy. It, meaning the animal already healthy and gets vaccination to stay healthy. And that brings me to the end of the first part of raising the cattle. Let's talk about second stage of raising cattle and how it gets to the people table. Once those little calves grow all the way from 100 pounds to 1,000 and become grown-up animals, which takes about one year, we take them usually one by one to the butcher. It's an Ontario proof facility not far from me, probably about 10 minutes, main on a run. And over there, those guys cut the meat, freeze it, and most importantly, inspect it to make sure that the quality is good. After that, we get the call from them. I go there, pick up the meat and bring it back to the farm. And on the farm, it will go straight to the large freezers that we have here until people buy from us. And that's how beef from our farm gets to the people table. And as I said, who knows, maybe even your table. That's all? There's another four crates. Oh, yeah, okay, okay. And we are back to the farm from the butcher with all the meat right here behind me. I am pretty happy with the quantity. By the way, if you like my video and would like to show support, please make sure to subscribe, click like, leave potentially a comment below to let me know. I would really appreciate it. And I will see you in the next video.